Forgive me, Father, for I have sinned. Brother, I ain't no father. I just thought this would be an interesting way for us to meet. Did you like the way I was blinking that flashlight so you'd know where I was? Like a lighthouse for Jesus. You can call me Pastor Marty. That's what everybody calls me. Except for those folks at the United Assembly for the Redeemed. I believe that in their weaker spiritual moments, they refer to me as that chubby little son of a bitch. Um... Why a confessional booth? Well, you wanted to talk to me about writing a tell-all book, and I figured what'd be more appropriate than a confessional booth. But you're not a priest. Heavens no! But it's amazing what you can do and where you can go with the right place donation to the right orphanage, the right moment to just the right priest, if you know what I mean. So you got my letter. Why are we whispering? Well, I'm Catholic. Like this, you whisper. Really? I don't whisper anything. Like it says in the Holy Scriptures, I believe we ought to shout things from the housetops. I don't know the Scriptures. Well, most people don't. That's what makes it so easy to quote them at will. Who's to say you're wrong? I don't know your story. Well, let's just say that Pastor Marty loved a little too much and a little too often with a little too many in front of a little tiny-minded group of people who had just a little grudge and started just a little bit of a rumor that ended up turning into a whole lot of trouble for me. Uh, three weeks in. As long as it takes. Well, you need any transportation. Oh, I just think I'll come up on the wings of angels. Seeing as I don't know what you mean, let me just assume okay. Now, these angels I was talking about that I just mentioned, well, they were kind of wondering what kind of money we're talking about. Now, you know, it, it doesn't make that much of a difference, but the laborer is worthy of his hire. Money. Well, there's a $3,000 advance. I... Oh, that should be fine. Oh, and I do require mineral water from the Holy Land for my drinking purposes. Mineral water? Holy Land. Gosh, why not? <laughs> and what are your sins, son? Pardon? Well, I thought since you're here in the confessional, I could give you some absolution. That's okay. You know, I'll just wait for the regular day guy to come back. Suit yourself. See you at Camp Bumblehead. What do you want to hear? I made porn movies. And I did them well. I guess you can say my claim to fame was I put a little story to the skin. I guess that was my way of making it seem okay. I guess. I don't know. I used to preach against you until I made a few mistakes myself and then people started preaching against me. You get different thinking when you're on the other side of the cactus, if you know what I mean. We all know what you mean. I met a woman one night at a telethon. Never occurred to me that she'd have any other motives other than just, well, just being attracted to me. I slept with her. God, I enjoyed it. Thought she was mighty hot. She wasn't just hot, friends. She was wired for sound, video. Next thing I knew, I was in the middle of a scandal. And then the scandal breaks, and... I know what you're gonna say, preacher. Well, I guess I came out here in the middle of piles of rocks to find out if there was a way to just love people and help them do better without having to hurt them, preach at them, or tell them how really rotten they are.